All right, so we're officially in the 40s now. Uh, so 49 days till the wedding. Last night was eventful, to put it lightly. Um, but yeah, got through it. Um, right now I am at a destination charger. So those are superchargers. I'm at a destination charger. I just threw some electrons into the car um, while I had lunch and it is one o'clock. I'm about to start my drive to visit my dad out in Southern California. So um, I'm gonna have a, um, just a, like a good talk with him um, about a couple things about the wedding, a couple guests, et cetera, et cetera. So um, I need to get down there and it just like every weekend seems to be so busy. So I'm gonna do that and um, yeah, should be a pretty good ride. I have the test camp in the back, so if I get sleepy along the way, um, I could always stop. I want to take this um, drive as easily as possible, so like stop along the way, um, check out shops, eat food, eat snacks, um, and just enjoy it, you know? So uh, normally I would be at work still, so I'm going to go take advantage of this extra time I have, and um, hopefully the weekend doesn't go by so fast down there like it normally does. So let the journey begin. All right, so I am by Mono Lake. And um, one of the things that I'm doing on this trip this time is, you know, like I said, I was, my plan is to take my time. Um, but I am just stopping at places where there's like parks or, um, food next to free charging so because i want to like slow down because like you could go in and you know do superchargers which is way cheaper than gas but you know it's kind of cool to see these like free services that are available um like right now you know i'm right by the lake and then there's a really cool barbecue restaurant that i'm going to go try out and you know the entire time that you know i'll be at the restaurant um the car will be charging so um i kind of want to like play with that i want to see you know how just how cheap <laughs> i can make it down to socal uh so far i've stopped um at one supercharger um but i only i only put like six dollars into it um it's just like one of the spots I always like to stop at, but, um, I guess I didn't necessarily need to, but yeah, I'm just like taking it easy. Um, feeling good right now. I took a nap at a park earlier. Um, but it's been a nice, easy drive. So yeah, we'll see how this continues. I'm excited to eat. I'm hungry. It is five. So, all right. Until later. to just end up being a hammer looking for nails basically and i had a lot of trouble that, that is a ford mock e i still do if i'm being honest there are times all electric so mustang just like the yes in all caps and like marquee lights and the uh, yes okay fine then I, I when it bashes me over the head with like awesomeness i know what that feels like but if it's in some cases a meeting or an investment All right, so it is 9.13 and I decided that I don't feel like arriving in like Southern California, um, like in the middle of the night because it's just like really inconvenient and finding a spot like to stay. Um, so I'm just staying at a rest stop about, I think it's probably about an hour and a half, two hours away from where I'm going. Um, but I set up my test camp mattress, which is really nice, really soft. Um, I'm really excited to try it out for the first time. Um, I've been just using my sleeping bag anytime I um, camped in my um, Tesla. 
but um but yeah it's super comfortable i have pillows so i'm all ready um may watch a movie or play some switch and um and then start early tomorrow i love it so whenever i go camping i always wake up super early so i could probably hit the road you know right when the sun comes up and um get over to my friends and family you know early so we maybe we could go to breakfast or something but um i think this is a much better way um and i'll actually get a full night's sleep whereas if i go right now i'll arrive late and then there's all the conversations you have to have and you know talking to everybody and you know it just gets later and later and you finally get to sleep then you're gonna wake up early anyways and you're exhausted so um i think this is the much much better choice and i'm really excited about it i'm excited to have this option like having the tesla um uh, i just feel very fortunate like i love having this option it's such a cool like i'm safe in here the car um is in camp mode it has it's keeping temperature it's safe and secure it's recording everything so i just like it feels so good and um so far um on this trip i've spent i think it's 20 like four dollars 24 dollars um you know in and i've been driving all over the place going to different places and you know just taking my time so uh, if I would have been in my Mustang or my truck, I'd be easily a few hundred with normal gas prices. I can only imagine right now. So, um, like I said, I feel very lucky. There's a ton of cool spots that have solar panels out and they just have free charging. So that's really fun. Uh, but you have to take it slow. You have to enjoy the journey uh, for those options. Otherwise, you use superchargers, which are everywhere, but it just costs you know a little bit more but um a lot less than gas by far so all right well i'm gonna wrap it up and get some sleep well you can see i'm at a rest stop you can see some of the semis everyone's just snoozing and up front camp mode is enabled yeah but it's really cool it's like it's a lot of room people ask you know i'm six foot two and i fit in the tesla model three and i have lots of room so um someone else could fit in here wouldn't be ideal um but you could do it you know if, if you're gonna save a couple hundred bucks on a room like it could be worth it just depends on what your comfort is worth um but like me personally this is awesome like i'm super comfortable um and i'll do this all the time so all right till tomorrow bye